This is an introduction to the Malacca Johor Diocese. In 1511, Portuguese colonialists led by Admiral Afonso de Albuquerque invaded Malacca, which was a well-known port trading in spices. With them came the first Catholic chaplains. Years later, St. Francis Xavier arrived and began preaching in Malacca from 1545 until 1553. And in 1558, it became a suffragan to the Archdiocese of Goa. In 1641, the Portuguese lost their hold on Malacca to the Dutch. The Dutch authorities in power suppressed Catholicism. As a result, the bishops and priests residing in Malacca fled to the island of Timor. Then in 1825, the Dutch would relinquish Malacca to the British rulers. During the next 60 plus years, the Catholic faith was administered by visiting priests and religious. In 1888, Malacca was given a diocesan role, hence the Diocese of Malacca and later to the non-metropolitan Archdiocese of Malacca. After the formation of the Malayan Federation, the Catholic administration was divided into three territories, hence the formation of Kuala Lumpur, Penang and Malacca Singapore Diocese respectively. Subsequently, as the Malacca Singapore Diocese grew over the years, in 1955 it was renamed the Metropolitan Archdiocese of Malacca Singapore. Later, after Singapore gained its own independence as a sovereign nation, the Metropolitan Archdiocese of Malacca Singapore was renamed the Malacca Johor Diocese in 1972. Then, the Right Reverend James Chan was appointed as the diocese's first bishop. After his retirement from office, the Right Reverend Paul Tan was appointed the second bishop in 2003. And subsequently, upon his retirement from office in 2015, the Right Reverend Anthony Bernard Paul was announced as the successor, the third and current bishop of Malacca Johor Diocese. The diocese currently consists of 22 parishes spread over three vicariates, namely the South Johor Vicariate, North Central Johor Vicariate, and Malacca Vicariate. There are currently 42 priests, 10 permanent deacons, 41 religious brothers and sisters, currently serving approximately 41,500 Catholics. The diocese is home to numerous retreats and welfare centers, such as Majidi Center, the Good Shepherd Catholic Seminary, Graceville, Villa Paulos, St. John Vianney Retreat House, and St. Pio Friary and Spirituality Center. The Malacca Johor Diocese Mission Pastoral Institute oversees the operations of the various pastoral ministries, which serves in the following areas. The language apostolate for the Bahasa, Chinese and Tamil speaking groups. The ministries of pastoral care that looks to the needs of family life, liturgy, the Bible, catechetical, counseling, charismatic renewal, youth, young adults, and campus students. The ministries of mission concerns look to the needs of human development, creation, aged, poor and destitute, refugees, migrants, itinerants, and also the Orang Asli. The Ministry of Ecumenical and Interreligious Dialogue seeks solidarity with various Christian denominations and other religions, and not forgetting the media apostolate and social communication that serve as a news outlet for the people through publications and modern multimedia. From the 2016 Diocesan Synod and the 4th Peninsula Malaysia Pastoral Convention, also held in the same year, the Malacca Johor Diocese has opted for and have been implementing the following five-year pastoral thrust, namely, church as communion of families, seek to be creative, inclusive bridge building, visionary and missionary, and to go forth as disciples of hope. The diocesan pastoral focus are deepening faith through formations and encounter programs, building believing communities through redesigning BEC approaches and offer alternatives, awakening the missionary spirit through awareness that everything we do can be evangelistic opportunities, adopt an e-approach strategy in parishes, ministries, services and formations levels with the foundational components of the four E's, namely, 
encounter, enlightenment, empowerment, and evangelization. For those watching this video, thank you for your time and kind attention. On behalf of our Malacca Johor Diocese, we hope and pray that you gain additional insights and information about our diocese. God bless.